Hello, my name is Ian Fryer. I'm the UK Engineering Director for RMD Quickform. I'd like to take you to see our new Ascent Climbing Formwork and Screen product. Ascent is a versatile product that can be used either for safety screens during high-rise construction or alternatively it can be used in core construction or wall construction as a climbing formwork. Both variants remain fixed on the wall or building whilst they're climbing and thus they can be climbed during conditions of high wind speed. Developed over a three year period with some major users of this type of product in the marketplace, Ascent has some cutting edge features which will bring benefits to any construction project requiring the use of climbing formwork or screens. We're here today at RMD Quickform's Aldridge headquarters in the Midlands in the UK, where behind me you can see a team assembling Ascent screens for use on the King's Cross T6 building, a 25 storey tower block is being constructed in central London in a very tight timescale. On this project, over 40 ascent screen modules, ranging in size from 3 metres to 4.5 metres wide and nearly 12 metres high, are being used to prevent egress of construction debris from the construction front in the crowded city environment. The security that ascent screens provide to the construction workforce enables production cycles to be achieved faster than if non-screened construction is used. The ascent screen product also enables companies to incorporate logos, banners or in fact any full printed graphics on the outside of the screens. The revenue that can be gained from advertising in a city centre environment can be very large indeed. One of the other features that's unique about the Ascent screen is this edge member on the side of the unit. This is detailed so that it can be rotated either 45 degrees in one direction or the other direction. And it's this feature which is key to systemizing the corners of the screen around the building. On an outside corner, the edge will be rotated 45 degrees this way and will mate with its neighboring screen coming off in this direction. On an internal corner, the edge will be rotated in this direction and the neighbouring screen will come off in this direction. Another unique feature of the Ascent screen system is this compressible PVC strip that is captivated within this edge member here. The strip is compressible and it's this feature that's vital to sealing the gaps between adjacent Ascent screens. When they're positioned next to each other, the compressible seals eliminate any gap preventing construction debris from leaving the building. Ascent screens are large rectangular modules. When they go onto the building it's important that each screen has been assembled square otherwise adjacent screens are not going to butt up to each other. The way that RMD Quickform ensure this is by building the screen units on this custom built jig the jig ensures that the masts are at the right centres, that they're parallel to each other, that they're square to each other, and by using a spirit level during the assembly of this upper section, we can make sure that the unit is assembled square on plan as well. All really important when it comes to assembling the equipment quickly around the building when we get to site. The bracing system on the ascent screen consists of rigid bracing here which sets the masts at a standard two and a half meter centers but also there are chain braces here which are used both to set the plan dimension of the plan squareness of the unit and also between units where masts are at non-standard centers. Chain braces have got turnbuckles at the end which enable the equipment to be quickly adjusted and the chains are able to be shortened by using these links and then in a fine way by rotating the bodies of the turnbuckles. I'm just about to adjust this unit to make sure that the unit is square on plan. Finally we finish with tightening the lock nuts on the braces. And that's it, that brace is now set. Screen units are manufactured in two distinct sections. The upper section is made using super slim soldier primary beams. 
Super Slims connect via this Z frame here to the ascent mast, this position here. Ascent masts are manufactured from very high yield steel. That enables the weight of the modules to be reduced to a minimum. This unit fully assembled will weigh under two tonnes. Connecting the upper and lower section of the screen together, you have this Z frame unit here. It's the Z frame that provides the support to the platform that runs around the edge of the building. 1.2 metres wide, the platform enables the edge formwork to the slab to be placed and also if the slab is to be post-tensioned, the post-tensioning crew can stand on here and use their hydraulic equipment to stretch the strands through the slab whilst they're grouted and anchored. On the top of the Z frame also, you have these lifting points. These bespoke lifting points each have a, an individual load test certificate and it's those that enable the equipment to be lifted when the equipment is raised by a crane. The lifting points connect by these pins and have a number of positions that they can connect to along the Z-frame. Each of these is rated at two and a half tonnes.